But when the sun sets here in Madison County, the town begins to come alive. lightning of the Madison County storm, then the thunder comes from the man they call Cur Dog. I started talking on the line, Guts and God, in 1986 to high school football teams. And in 88, I added the Cur Dog to it. Football is a game of blocking and tackling and wanting it in heart. It takes something to play football. Here's what I'm telling you. You are the home of the damn line. Guts and God, Cur Dog style, and you represent the line every time you go on that football field, and the line is Madison County football. They are one and the same, and what we take dead aim on, what it really does mean, cowboy football. I remembered my daddy throwing rocks out at the barn from my granddaddy's farm, and my granddaddy told him, said, John Allen, you can throw those rocks all you want to, but tomorrow them old dogs gonna be there. It doesn't matter if it's raining, sleeting, hailing, snowing, whatever. When that sun comes up tomorrow, he'll be there. Four quarters time, 12 minutes. We're going to have the guts to keep doing it no matter what happens. And when the gun goes off at the end of this ball game, just like that dang old cur dog out there, we're going to be there, son. You hear me? We have come to play and play smart, and that is Cowboy football. Now let's play like champions and stand up. Them boys gonna set the tone on the team. Madison County roster includes 28 seniors and two high school All-Americans, defensive tackle Jacoby McDaniel and running back Chris Thompson. Madison County Cowboy number 55 defensive lineman Jacoby McDaniel is a student to look up to. His presence on the field is intimidating to the opposing teams, and if he can't be stopped, they know what will happen. Along with his hard work on the field, Jacoby still likes to have fun. We breed football, baby! Trust, love, passion, sacrifice! This high school All-American reflects sportsmanship and discipline. He not only impresses fans, but his mother is proud of him as well. I'm very proud of Jacoby Mike Daniel, um, all the things that he has done with football. So I want to be all he can be.
Recruited by Florida State University, Jacoby will take with him the skill set and knowledge from this coaching staff and transfer the pride and honor from being a Cowboy to being a Seminole. And joining McDaniel at Florida State will be Madison's second All-American, number one running back Chris Thompson. Thompson is a rare find amongst high school athletes, a young man who possesses sprinter speed, fullback power, and receiver hands. He hate to lose. Ever since he was a little boy, he hated to lose. Nintendo games, he just hate to lose. I would train him to be a wide receiver because he had speed. When we went to Pee Wee League, the coach wanted to try him at running back, but I was scared for him because he was a little bit of boy. And I said, no, nah, it's not going to work out. But I was wrong. <laughs> Representing Madison as team captain, Chris shows that the Cowboys are here to compete. His handling of the ball, movement of his feet, and ability to scan ahead represent reasons why his jersey reads number one. The 2008 season was an unbelievable year for the Madison County Cowboys. The team started off right by averaging over 50 points a game in the first half of the season and finishing strong with an 11-1 record, coming just one game shy of making a second straight appearance in Florida's Class 2A championship game in Orlando. The seniors will graduate and the underclassmen will step up. And the Cowboys will live to fight another season with passion, sacrifice, and integrity. That's Cowboy football. <laughs>